Hi guys, episode 17, um, group 3, results, and I'm just gonna go through this really fast. I mean, almost as fast as they did, actually, because Lil got through right away. Like, they did not waste time. Um, I mean, of course they had the group song first, which was, um, Katy Perry, Hot and Cold, which was kind of weird. Just really weird, actually. Um... And, I don't know, they just, uh, decided, I guess, to go through the results really fast because they had to announce wild cards, which is also why, um, Jason Castro was supposed to perform and they totally just cut him from the show for time constraints because they had to announce the wild cards, which kind of sucks, but I was really looking forward to seeing Jason perform, but, um, yeah, so they basically put Lil through right away. That was the fastest thing ever. And then they automatically pulled up, like, five more people. And they're like, one of these people is getting through. And looking at the people that were standing up, I'm not even going to call them the talent that was standing up because half of them just sucked. I hated Group 3. But, um, you knew it was going to be Scott getting through just looking at them. I mean, I think it was, was it Kristen or Kendall? One of the two. One of the two interchangeable blondes um, was sitting next to Scott, and then there were a couple other, like, dispensable ones, I guess. Um, I don't remember who exactly it was, but it was just people who really weren't worth it. Um, <laughs> you knew it was going to be Scott. Um, and then um, at the end of the um, results part, Jorge got in, and they didn't let him do a sing-out, which I thought was really weird, but then they did it at the end of the show. I guess they wanted the sing-out to close the show or whatever. Okay. But when they picked the wild cards, I was sitting there, like, freaking out, hoping, oh my god, please let Matt get one, please let Matt get a spot, please let Matt get a spot. And, I don't know, like... They picked Jessie, which I was surprised they picked Jessie, because she just, I don't know. I mean, she was good, but I don't think she does enough. Like, um, and they picked Megan. I'm trying to, I'm not doing this in any particular order. I'm just trying to get, like, all the girls out of the way, all the guys out of the way, whatever. So it was Yeah, like I said, just Megan and then I was happy to see her. Um that's Jesse, Megan Tatiana, which I thought was a waste of time. And Jasmine, which I don't know, something just turns me off about her, but whatever. Um and then for the guys, they picked Ricky, and they picked Vaughn. I thought picking Vaughn was really weird. Then they finally picked Matt, and oh, I swear to God, I, I just, like, I felt so good after that. But then, like, my mind immediately went from, yay, they picked Matt, to... Oh my god, they picked Matt. He better do good. He better do good. He better get in. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm so nervous. But, like, I don't know. Um, and, finally, I mean, poor Noop getting stuck at the end there. And they tried to, like, mess with his head, you know, making him the last one in, even though he was the most obvious, according to Simon. But, um, like, I don't know. So I'm happy to see that Matt and Anoop and Megan are in it and I'm hoping those are the three wild card spots that get picked are those three I'm pumped I'm excited and let's see what happens on the wild card show things should be fun see you guys next time